She was keen to learn, she sought advice, she took advice, and she was absolutely determined to work across party for the causes that she passionately believed in. And she worked with Andrew Mitchell and other Conservative colleagues to uh, set up the cross party group on Syria. She was instrumental in forcing the government to change its policy and getting them to accept the 3,000 unaccompanied Syrian asylum seeking children. And she was a force of nature, and um, if there were any obstacles in her path, um, she would uh, not go around them, she would go straight through them. Uh, and at a time when the, it's a common criticism that so many of our politicians are career politicians, but they've never done anything else but come out of university and go straight into politics, she had a hinterland, didn't she? She had done other things, particularly in the field of, of development aid with NGOs, and what she had done informed her then when she became a politician. That's right. Jo had a long and distinguished career in the humanitarian field, and she'd worked for Oxfam and um, Save the Children and SPCC. So she had a huge amount of experience to call on, and she had campaigned globally, and she brought all of that wisdom, that insight, back to Batley, back to the, the, the area where she was born and brought up, to represent and to fight 